Switzerland, and the Netherlands, both top contenders in Eurovision 2024, secured places in Saturday's final, alongside Israel, despite protest and booing during Israel's performance. The event in Malmö, Sweden, drew 100,000 visitors with heavy police presence due to potential unrest. Swiss rapper Nemo and Dutch artist Juist Klein qualified with their songs, while Israeli soloist Eden Galan's performance faced mixed reactions. Galan's participation sparked controversy, with calls to exclude Israel over political reasons, but Eurovision organizers maintained it as a non-political event. Protest from both pro-Palestinian and pro-Israeli groups occurred outside of the event, NBC News has reported. Despite the controversy, Galan expressed pride in representing Israel. Other countries like Armenia, Austria, Estonia, Georgia, Greece, Latvia, and Norway also qualified for the final. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu praised Galan's participation, highlighting it as a stand against anti-Semitism. 